All right, guys. So hurry it up. Huh? You heard me. I said, hurry it up. All right. So today hurry it up. Shut your mouth, Biden. Continue, Donald. Before I was rudely interrupted, we all know that George Washington was the first president of the United States, right? Yes, it's common knowledge. Uh, uh, yes, I think, didn't he build a wall or something? That was Trump Joe. Oh. Idiot. Well, anyways, there is a myth that he is still alive, and he's being kept in the Central Museum in the city. Rumors say that you can only see him walking in the museum at night when it is closed. Wouldn't him still being alive mess up this timeline? Yeah, because he shouldn't be here. That's why we are going to go assassinate him. So let's pick what car we want to take out today. That 4x4 truck looks really nice. Where'd you get it from? It was in my garage. Don't forget, you can't go wrong with the classic presidential limo. I forgot the limo has a freezer in it. How am I supposed to eat my ice cream in that truck? I don't know, figure it out. Boy, huh? I'll grab your wide body ass and throw you off this mountain. You want to say that again? Say what? Chill, Donald, just forget it. Nah, stand on business. Say what you just said to me. Say it with your chest. I'll grab your wide body ass and throw you off this mountain. All right, I got something for you when we are done with this. Shiver me timbers. I'm so scared, buddy. We need the 4x4 to transfer the body. It's 2024 and you still act like an NPC. It's 2024 and you still ain't got no- Calm down, Donald. Focus on driving us down there. I need you two ladies to breathe in and out. I haven't transitioned, though. Yeah. Just breathe in and out and calm down. How about you calm down, young man? I know something to make you guys chill out. Have you heard about what happened to Bill Clinton? Crazy man. None of our business, even though his wife is an NPC. Hey, bot. Huh? Wait, who? You, are you ready to be in federal prison this year? Just be quiet, bro. Wait, I've never been to the museum we are going to. Where is it? Down in the city, it's usually jam-packed. But since it's closed right now, there shouldn't be too many people in the building. But outside, maybe another story. Hey, Mr. President, I just got word in from Bill Clinton is asking for money to pay off his court fees and lawyers. Do you want me to send him the $560,000 he asked for? Or do you want me to leave him on read? It's Get up, choice, Bozo. Mr. Learn how to ride the bike next time. Don't go downhill so fast. Don't send him anything dispatch. All right, guys, we are basically here. So just a reminder, the game plan is to run in there, find Washington, and assassinate him, all right? There are way too many people outside. You need to scare them away, Donald. Don't worry about that. I have the perfect thing to do exactly what you said. Hey guys, standing near the museum, I would move because I don't think you will like what I'll pull out next, all right? Still don't want to move, huh? Show them who we are, Donald John Trump. At least there was one smart person. I won't be lenient to the rest of you guys, though. I think I see someone with their phone out calling 911 Donald. Oh, really? Yeah. Say less, it's on site now. I was just going to pull out a simple assault rifle, but now I'm pulling out the Obama-minator. Go home! We are implementing a new curfew. You may not visit the museum at this time. Go home now or you will be arrested and sent to jail. This is your final warning. The power that thing has is absolutely insane. I'm gonna need myself a Obama-minator one of these days. Keep dreaming, buddy. Let's go in, guys, and deal with George Washington so we can fix the timeline. Oh, wow, this place actually looks really cool. Before we go assassinate him, can we enjoy ourselves a bit? Yeah, sure, I guess for once we could enjoy ourselves. Yeah, we need some new photos for the Instagram. Instagram, I don't think we reminded the people about our Instagram. Hey, Joe, give them a reminder. You aren't following us on Instagram? What are you waiting for, man? We have an account called POTUS Play, and we're trying to follow back as many people as we can. So Stand hop on still. Instagram and hit the follow button. Show them some of the pictures we have posted, including the one we just took. Man, imagine if dinosaurs were still alive. Wouldn't that be really crazy, guys? I think I'd flee the planet at that point. I mean, it can't be so bad. We have modern technology. If you think I'd sit there while watching a massive T-Rex sprint towards me and keep shooting, you are on a lot of Zaza. We have nuclear weapons, though. Like 10% of the Earth is filled with human cities and structures. What's stopping dinosaurs from being in a place like New York? Are you going to bomb the city? You have a point. Hey, Donald, look at me. I just took down this massive dinosaur. Yo, bro. Huh. You ain't do hey. shit, buddy. Keep What was that? Biden? I called you up here because I was exploring and I saw a man with a musket in his hand. It's probably just a statue. Don't be scared, Biden. It was blinking, though. It can't be that bad. Damn, it's George Washington. Now he knows we're here because you wanted to scream. How are we going to deal with this guy now, dumbass? All right, here's the game plan. You will grab your pistol out of your pocket and like a Fortnite Running player, turn your neck and aim you think, for his huh? head, all right? Then rush in, grab the body, and then run out. Barack is at the exit from the second floor to the first. So we have a bit of security. Be careful because people will hear the gunshot and the cops will be called. All right, thank you, Joe. Now I know what I need to do. Aim for the head and try to not get shot. Donald John Trump, I am the future president of the no, United going to be States me, you for idiot. the next two years, so I need to fulfill this mission. All right, I need to make sure my aim is perfect for this. Here we go, say goodbye the first. 
This is from the new generation. We have no need for you anymore. He's shooting back Biden. I repeat, it is not a statue. It is George Washington. Holy shit. Damn, your aim is unmatched, Trump. Got to make sure he's fully gone so the timeline isn't affected. That man should have been gone hundreds of years ago, and it's me who had to finish the job. The great Donald Trump. Stop being egotistical, Donald. How is that being egotistical? You aren't great. You aren't special, buddy. You are like the rest of us. I think we fully finished off George Washington. Let's dump his body and replace the statue with a statue of Barack or something. Hey, I like that idea, man. Make it out of plastic, though, and use some paint because I don't feel like spending money. It'll only cost like $2 million. What do you mean by you don't feel like spending money? Come here, Georgie. We are going to the dumpster. I hear the cops coming, so we need to get out of this place as uh, soon as possible. Hey, Mr. President, there is a lot of commotion going outside. Oh, really? I can't hear it. In. Sources are saying they saw George Washington being shot four times, and everyone is going wild. The police are after your head, and they won't even arrest you. I think they are out to kill you. Damn. I don't know what you did or why that man is still alive. But stay safe. We need you to bring justice to this world. Thank you for letting us know, dispatcher. Don't worry, I'll make it out alive. We will deal with this issue as a team and get this timeline fixed no matter what by disposing this body. Hold on, hold on. What? This quote-unquote team, count me out unless I get the biggest chocolate chip sundae I've ever seen in my life tonight, buddy. How about you two stop running into walls and everyone gets ice cream sundaes after this? All right, bet. I want the most over-the-top ice cream sundae and that shit better smack you hooligan. Call me a hooligan again and you ain't getting nothing. Threaten me again and I'll expose all your secrets, you hooligan. Chill out. I'm sorry, man. We were stupid for not taking out the alarms first. I bet there are so many cops outside. Move it, Barack. Why the hell do I hear like 50 cop sirens? This is bad. We need to get out of here fast and quick. And this is the exact reason why I wanted to take the limo. But you wanted to take this dog water four by four. I mean, you could have just put the body in the trunk and gone on with our day. I hear reloading. Move, move, move. Hurry it up, Barack. Move it, Barack. Move it. Breaking news tonight. Former Presidents Barack Obama, Donald Trump, and Joe Biden are on the run after allegedly assassinating George Washington, who shouldn't be alive in a museum. The nation is in disbelief as law enforcement scrambles to apprehend the trio. Questions abound about the motive behind this audacious act, a bizarre turn of events that has left the nation on edge. Stay tuned for updates on this unprecedented situation as it unfolds. Man, the dispatcher was right. This is bad. We need to get rid of this body fast and lose these cops, damn. Hurry it up, Barack. Why is everyone saying my name so suddenly? I don't know, Barack. Do something, Barack. All right, here's the plan. Head to the underground tunnels near the highway and drive to the drain that leads to the ocean. We can dump the body there and no one will find it because we are too busy exploring other planets instead of our own, which is kind of crazy in my opinion. Good job, Hussein. Finally, a good plan for us to follow, man. You have grown a lot. Hey, Mr. President, could you chill out on the amount of explosives you are using because I don't want to have you pay for property damage. Not paying for anything, so it doesn't matter. All right, Barack, you said the tunnel was here, so I'm trusting we will lose the cops this time, man. I can't believe we actually assassinated the first president of the United States. We were basically formed by him, and now we ended him. I mean, it was for this planet, so I guess that justifies our reason a little bit. Go pick him back up, Donald, and put him into the bed. Why the hell didn't you fasten him the first time, damn? Well, maybe it was because I was getting shot from all angles by heavy-duty police weaponry, and I wanted to see my wife tonight and not die, you idiot. Shit, I repeat, we have been spotted. I repeat, we have been spotted. Hurry it up, little duckling. We are being shot at. We can't have them following us into these tunnels if you know you know these tunnels are sacred because they help people run away from cops. I never know why they just don't drive in here. Well, I'm sorry, Mr. Barack Obama, that I'm driving a truck with a body in the back unfastened. How about you tell me that dumb shit again, buddy, before I get tight? Forget that Donald, where the hell is my ice cream sundae that I was promised I want that deluxe Delaware delight. Vanilla and chocolate swirl ice cream topped with a generous drizzle of hot fudge, sprinkled with crushed chocolate chip cookies, and finished off with a dollop of whipped cream and a cherry on top. What is a dollop, buddy? You ain't special for stealing my order. Oh, so now you want to steal my order? I need Madagascar vanilla bean ice cream, rich Belgian chocolate fudge, pecan praline crunch, salted caramel drizzle, freshly whipped cream, and luxurious dark chocolate shavings. If you don't stop yapping, damn it, you won't get your shavings, ice cream, whatever, bro. We are running from the cops, and you are giving me your order like I'm going to memorize that transcript you just said. But if I were to get a sundae, it would have rare Tahitian vanilla bean ice cream. 
drizzled with a 25-year aged balsamic reduction, infused with hand-harvested black hospital. truffle ganache, adorned with genuine edible gold leaf, Someone tell this man to shut up with this yapping. luxurious whipped mascarpone, and crowned with diamond-dusted macadamia nut praline, all served in a crystal-chiseled dessert vessel. Thanks for spelling out that you are a billionaire without saying it directly, you bastard. I hope you fall off a flight of stairs just like Joe Biden. I hope it happens on live television too, so people can start making fun of you. Anderson Cooper here, reporting on a truly unexpected turn of events. Former presidents Joe Biden, Barack Obama, and Donald Trump managed to evade law enforcement after a citywide chase. The nation is left in disbelief as the trio's escapade raises questions about security protocols and the potential impact on public trust. Stay tuned for updates as we navigate this unusual situation. Good job, guys. No problem, man. All right, come here, George Washington. I just wanted to say thank you for everything you have done for this country. We could never pay you back, but sadly, you shouldn't be alive currently. So we had to assassinate you to help save the world. And I'm not sorry about that. So hopefully, I don't know, you can float around deep in the ocean and see what our government never wants to see or whatever. I don't know. Just get off land forever. Biden, are you slow? Get on the bridge before you get swept away. We need to send George Washington to the ocean so he can never be found ever again for the rest of humanity hey. and this nation. Man, this entire adventure has just opened up my eyes. I feel like we should do more adventures like this. How about we get into that damn truck and go get some expensive ass ice cream sundaes, guys? Am I right? It's time for me to pull out my wallet and spend the most money I've ever spent. Hey, and Biden. I want you to sit in the back this time. I have a really nice surprise for you that I know you won't miss. Not only are we getting more ice cream, I have four chocolate chip ice cream, ice cream. mini sundaes in the back of the truck that I told the dispatcher to set up, and I just put it in the car. Thank you so much, Donald. Activate shock. It was low voltage. Why is he screaming? Screw you, Donald.